is the Dragon Sail Puppets Variety Channel. Star, Syringa, Bruce, Catatop, and Henri. Featuring the Dragon Sail Puppets Band. Anchors away. Now think 
Like the masterpiece we just unfurled before you. <laughs> Amazing the music you can get out of bleary eyed fools if you wiggle the fear of God in front of their faces. <laughs> so look out, boys. I'm about to rag on y'all a little bit. Oh, they're already gone anyway. <laughs> Did somebody say CBD? <laughs> Lord, I should be so lucky. <laughs> well, at least they're not chasing tail like they used to. <laughs> The plummeting of testosterone levels, music to Surrender's ears. <laughs> and y'all, y'all wouldn't believe it, but that storm cloud thought for a hot minute years ago that he would make a good doctor. One of his friends told him he could make a lot of money as a gynecologist. I told him that that job is not all it's cracked up to be, <laughs> and he needed to get back behind the skins and you know do God's work. Besides. I'm pretty sure that to become a doctor, you need to be able to pass at least one drug test. <laughs> and you can always count on that Bobby to back his zero turn into the pond. <laughs> oh, now I can tell by that glazed expression on some of your faces that you don't know what in sweet mercy the Southern Queen is talking about. <laughs> so I put it this way. Bobby thought he would be a big help to me early by introducing me to a promoter. Okay. First, she invites her silly ass over to my house, which you do not do. The only reason I let her come over is because Chi-Chi had been cooking kimchi in my place, and I shouldn't be the only one to suffer. And she say, now don't you go to any trouble on my account. Well, what trouble did she expect me to go to? There's coffee and there's tea. <laughs> be grateful. And oh, don't you know, I knew there was going to be trouble. When I saw her car pulling into the drive, I told Chi-Chi, those bicycles on the back are gonna fly off and kill somebody. <laughs> Hell, they were strapped down by a dog collar. <laughs> and also, also when she said to me, she was a songwriting expert and she could help make my creations more commercial. <laughs> so you know I had to kill her, right? <laughs> I ain't having nobody messing with my music. My music is my church, have mercy. So keep your smack out of my offertory bowl, hussy. <laughs> but you know, I don't let people into my place anymore. I tell the paparazzi to meet me over at that cat woman's place. Where of course everyone is always so blown away by those white columns in front of her condo complex. <laughs> but that fancy hussy knows how to play her hand. Because then she'll expect me to attend one of her tea parties, also known as Descent into the Black Sucking Hole, <laughs> so that she can have some star power there. <laughs> now, one day, Surrender's gonna have us some white collars. But until then, I ain't entertaining anybody in my dinky little wormhole apartment. That place just screams destitute stripper or washed up Hollywood cokehead circa 1991. <laughs> I mean, at least it does have that sense of history about it. <laughs> and 
you know, I always had my Chi-Chi over there blowing out the Easy Bake Oven or sewing up costumes for the show while every surface is draped with fabric pieces and Bob Mackey feathers drifting through the living room and shooting down your windpipe and nearly choking your ass to death. <laughs> but enough about my piece of paradise. We got yet another award-winning show. We have GB Fusion and Thomas Lydon as our talented special guest. So where do we get started? Oh, and if you see me coughing and sputtering and grabbing at my throat, you'll know the reason why. <laughs> Send help. <laughs> Talent? Check. And now, emitting a fragrance to seduce the world. If you want to be like me, huh, you got to smell like me. That's why Surrender has gathered the finest Tennessee honeysuckle to produce the sweetest, sultriest notes that ever flew up your nose. Hours of painstaking work in the laboratory with you know, all those tubes, has created, finally, sweet lord, honeysuckle passion. What? Another marriage proposal? <laughs> Get a hobby. So you know you want to scour the shelves at the Pinch My Penny for my fresh new fragrance. They'll have my picture up there smiling. And looking like I just smelled dog poop, but hell, I didn't have time for a retake. Oh, Surrender's got an empire to run. How does she do that? A little late, hon, but thank you. Brilliance? Yes. Luminescence? Yes. And now she smells good. So buy you some honeysuckle passion, honey. And remember, you ain't allowed to dress like me, but you can smell like me. Oh, no, I am done with the spin. You're just going to have to run old footage from now on. It makes me want to throw up. Oh, God. I ain't some Tinkerbell Pop-Tart ballerina all up on a tippy toe. Oh, shit. Everyone, welcome to the show, the smart, sinewy musical brilliance that is GB Fusion. Y'all give it up. <laughs>
Okay, all right. Now, do we have cool lights set up? I don't know, Hussy. They said we need cool lights trained on us. Warm lights on the green screen, cool lights on us, something like that. I don't know. And is this a fresh coat of gray paint on this concrete? Well, I want to make sure it's dry because, you know, Bruce, Lord. You know, you gotta love the continuity. <laughs> you know how old wartime shipping vessels are full of gray concrete walls. <laughs> All right. Oh, Lamb of God. <laughs> Y'all get it together. Henri, hun, do you boys have everything you need here? Water bowls, squeaky toys. Well, I don't have my chocolate bunny ears. They said there was no more chocolate bunny ears in the cupboard, uh, and I think I'm very upset. Is it at all possible that you ate all the chocolate bunny ears, hun? It's a theory. Mm-hmm. I love chocolate bunny ears. I know, hon. Sometimes when I eat them, I love them so much, I can't stop eating them. And I get sick. Well, there's a reason for that, huh? Sugar is an addictive substance. You know, like cocaine. It's designed to make you not want to stop eating it. Oh, dear. I have a problem. I'm like... Bruce. Oh, sweet manger baby, don't ever go there. All right, you're on, hon. Okay. Bruce! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Guess what I've been doing? Uh... Eating watermelon. Oh, wow. It was very tasty. Bobby says eating watermelon is full of vitamin P. <laughs> oh, I wish you hadn't said that. Surrender says she wants us to come up with a reason for people to give a sweet toot about watching us. Yeah. Hey, why'd you put your pencils in the refrigerator? I wanted them to be fresh. Well, that's the reason I broke the French coffee maker dealie. That's not the reason. Okay, so, Bruce, how many chickens? I know, let's sing! Disco! Disco Biscuits! So, Re Surrender doesn't want you singing that anymore around the set. And why is that? She says that song belongs in a museum or the ash bin of history. Huh! And now we need to show our growth and our new one. <laughs> and she says. <laughs> Well, I wrote another song, Dealy, anyway, and here it goes. Uh -oh. I love you more than life itself. I put you on my loving shelf, so I'll push in the bush, my lord. Re uh, oh, appointment no. protect you with my steaming sword. She's not going to be happy. Oh, I know what'd be cool. You can use your hoodoo voodoo to make me invisible, and I'll go around moving stuff and freaking people out. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Oh, please. Well, well, no, we, we had to start on a Wednesday morning before sunrise. Yeah. And we need some black beans and the head of a dead man. Anybody on this ship looking a little peaky to you? How about if I draw your tarot card? Oh, no, you get to do that on your special show without me. Oh, here comes the waterworks. No, I was left all alone without suckers while those about me have promulgated their sworn assemblage. Oh, we could talk about uh, anything else. Hey, where'd you get your luminescent glow? My, my what? You're so shiny. Oh, well, I eat right and exercise, and I let them floss my teeth once a month. Oh, well, I don't go to the doctor because I'm already very healthy. Well, they said your glands need to be drained. No, when I scooch on the ground like that, it's because I like it like that. Well... Hey, I'm thinking of a number between one and two. Me too. Oh, oh, no, no, it's too many numbers. I can't, I can't keep up. Hey, do you know where there's some chocolate bunny ears? Uh, no, because they keep them in a special cabinet to which I am not permitted. Oh, here we go. Maybe somebody ate them all. 
Well, I don't like it. You could drink beer. Ooh, no. Besides, you are my cautionary tale. Introduce the guest. Oh, everyone, please clap your hands and jump up and down a lot for Thomas Lydon. <laughs> Hussies for Thomas Lydon and GB Fusion for gracing our show tonight. And for the less than four moderately severe electrocutions during the Pup Corner segment. 
<laughs> and now, listen to your mama and go live in life. Or, or suck, suck it up, up hussies. <laughs> Surrender's gowns, courtesy of the Pinch My Piggy Markdown Rack. Wardrobe consultation by Chi Chi's Productions. Personal assistant to Surrender, also that drag queen from Guatemala. Special promotional consideration by Georgia Hot Flash. With this fragrance, honey subtle passion. Now on back with me because some jive hussies can't type their way out of the burlap bag. Oh, I'm ready.